guys, it's Dwight, I'm back, how are you? Welcome to another episode of Poor Painting with Dwight. Um, hey guys, yeah, so it's Monday, um, got the day off today, and so I thought I'd try to get another painting in before I head back to work. And so I'm gonna do another dump and swirl today, but um, I'm gonna use as my dump color, I'm gonna use Artist Loft Acrylic Flow White this time. So I mix it up the same way with just a little bit of Liquitex pouring medium, um, two parts flow trawl to one part paint, and then of course water, gotta thin it out with water. And then this is the same, just a smaller part I'm gonna use with my puddles here. So let me go over my paints with you and show you what we got. So this blue is actually Deco Art Satin Enamels and it's called dark denim. And you know, I didn't have um, jeans that dark since the 1970s, so I don't know. It's an interesting blue. It's almost like a navy blue to me, but I guess I guess it's not. And so then I also have DecoArt um, metallic. This is heavy body and a zinc. And again, these are all mixed the same. One part paint, two parts Floetrol, and uh, drizzle of Liquitex pore medium and water. So then this is really pretty actually. It's called Deep Turquoise and again it's a heavy body paint. Um, I had to be careful. I had to end up straining this because I couldn't mix it all down um, and I had some lumps and that would have ruined everything. Um, so make sure if you use any heavy body paint you really have to to really uh, make sure it's, it's stirred in really nicely. Um, especially when you're tilting, that's the last thing you want, is a lump to ruin your cells or make a line all squiggly, um, or you don't want it to be squiggly. So just some things to think about. So as I'm doing here, I'm prepping the canvas. Uh, I'm just using Artist Loft Acrylic Flow White right out of the bottle. And I've said before in my videos, the reason I do this is because um, when I'm using thinned paints, I don't want um, the canvas to show through. Now, I'm using a white paint um, as my dump paint, so um, this should work out fine. Uh, but I still don't want necessarily like the texture of the canvas coming through. So just a light coat, just enough to make it tacky so when the paint goes over the edges, it'll stick. Um, there we go. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I am going to pour in order. I'm going to start with a white puddle, and then I'm going to put the, the dark denim down on top of that, and I'm going to throw that down or dump it. That's what we call dump and swirl. Another layer of white, I'm going to dump on top of that, and then I will dump the silver with the turquoise on top, and then we'll do the white. Um, so I haven't used a satin enamel in this process, and um, the denim is a satin enamel. I think I mentioned that earlier. If I didn't, I apologize, but it is, yeah, deco art um, satin enamel. So I know we've used the white, and we tend to use a lot of the white with, um, you know, the pearl pores and things like that. So we'll try the blue and see if we get some kind of a of a reaction. Okay guys, hold on, I'm just gonna put a little bit of extra water in my dump paint. Sometimes they thicken up as they sit. Okay, so, okay guys, here we go. Two thumbs up and see if we can make it happen.
guys, I'm back. Um, nothing happened. <clears throat> Very little. Uh, I gotta work on that. I don't know what it is with white. I mixed it up the same consistencies as the black, and this is what I got. Um, so I ran out of white, because I thought, you know, I thought that was gonna work for us today. And, um, sorry, I'm wiping paint off of me. And I mixed up some black Artist Loft Acrylic Flow for um, this dump and swirl. So I'm going to re-pour the colors, and we're gonna dump the paint, and then we're gonna put the black on top. And since I have this base coat already down here, I think it's gonna really make it light. So a lot of the cells, fingers crossed, will come up, um, and there'll be a lot of white. Uh, yeah, that's, that's my story. I'm going to stick to it. So guys, let's get started. Hey guys, I'm back. It's Dwight. Here is my painting. So as you noticed, I poured three times. I almost scraped the last one just to do a fresh canvas, um, but something just told me, hey, don't do it. And as you can tell, I didn't. So I'm liking this a lot. Um, I like sort of the off-centeredness of the negative space. It provides its own sense of symmetry in my mind. Um, I like that the cells down here are nice and dark, and there are lighter ones up top, so it sort of grounds the painting. Let me see if that makes it a little bit better. Yeah, that's a better, better shot of it. And I did use satin enamel, um, but only in the denim, the dark denim blue. Um, and actually, I think it was a nice addition. I'll show you some of the cells close up. That really turned out pretty cool. Now, because I'm such a perfectionist, I will probably go in here um, and just clean up the black a little bit. I'll show you what I mean in a minute. So let me get down on my hands and knees here and show you. So here we go. A lot of interesting color and, and definition. The blues. Look at the blues. Now it's bluer. Oh, the light's making it crazy in here. But look at that. Look at that. So like what I would do is just sort of clean these up in here. I like this one here with a little little dot in it. And then there's some, some haziness and fog, fogginess. I'll probably do that as well. Um, I got a few pop in through here, which is great. Um, and yeah, guys, that's what I'm talking about. So it takes, yeah, it takes a while for me sometimes to get what I like. I like this one a lot. Um, I think it has a lot of interest. And looky there, I got a little turquoise color <laughs> right there. Right in the middle. And then the, that little one over here, there too. So, and I like the edge. When you look back at it, it's like a white edge. Yay, so I'm pretty happy, guys. Okay. Hey, thanks again for taking me over the top. 10,000. Um, that's, you know, it's a nice accomplishment, and I feel good, and you guys are awesome. 
I love all the questions. I love all the support. And um, we'll see you this weekend. I'm doing a commission piece this weekend, so you can come along for the ride on that one. But it will be a um, probably a flip cup and drag, um, sort of like my Navarre series that I did uh, last month. Okay, guys, I will show you this when it's dry. Take care. Bye-bye.